Hi everybody, so today's tutorial is a really really easy one, it's like the simplest nail art you could ever do and it's so cool too, it looks so beautiful. So as you can see it's a gold glitter gradient, um, all you need is a gold nail polish or another colour, whatever you want, as well as a sponge of some sort and a base coat and top coat. Let me know if you like this video by giving me a thumbs up and subscribing to my channel and I hope you enjoy it. As always start off by painting your nails with a base coat. Then choose your glitter nail polish. I have chosen Maybelline Colour Show Gold's Night Out. If you've got quite prominent white tips like me, you might want to cover up your tips a bit more and disguise them by applying some of the gold first onto your tips. Once they're mostly covered, move on to the next bit. If you've got shorter nails, you can probably skip this step. I do most of my sponging with this makeup sponge. I really like the shape, it's really easy to hold but it's also not too big. But if you don't have one of those, you could always just use a kitchen sponge, just make sure it's nice and clean first. Dab some of your glitter nail polish onto one end of the sponge. Then carefully dab the sponge across the bottom three quarters of your nails. As this is a gradient, try to make sure there's less glitter at the top and more at the bottom. The type of glitter polish you use will have an effect on how the gradient comes out. I find chunkier glitters tend to be less about the tonal changes and more about the graduation of the actual bits, whereas in this finer glitter you can see the tone changing from a lighter grey to a darker grey. It's really a matter of preference. Now I've got to clean it up, um, it is a real pain to clean up glitter so I do not blame you if you peel it off in the shower. And now just apply a couple of coats of top coat. I have actually heard of special glitter toppers that are really good for smoothing out glitter polishes. So if you know anything about those, leave me a comment down below telling me and everybody else. Thank you for watching and if you did enjoy it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you later.